the following contests is scheduled for one fall and is for the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. He's back! The best in the world has arrived on the grandest stage of them all. CM Punk has done it all at WrestleMania. Won Money in the Bank, defended the WWE title, faced The Undertaker. But CM Punk wants one more bullet point on his WrestleMania resume. Compete in the main event and win. Punk possesses a lethal combination of fighting styles, and he's going to need it tonight. Yeah, no doubt about it, Punk is always ready for a fight, and he proclaims he is the measuring stick until someone proves him otherwise. The bloodline has arrived. Their dominance is historic. A faction that has amassed unparalleled power. And the bloodline is not afraid to showcase that power. WrestleMania, acknowledge them. Maybe the most dominant faction ever in sports entertainment. You might say WrestleMania is the only stage worthy of the bloodline. When it comes to the bloodline, the showcase of the Immortals is family business. Rikishi, the father of Solo and the Usos, has many WrestleMania matches under his belt. And Roman Reigns' father competed back at WrestleMania 4. The bloodline has expanded that legacy, grown on that history, and they intend to add to it tonight by doing what they do best, win.
This is still their yard. And the bloodline has survived rare losses, defections, yet still remain strong. Yeah, tonight is a showcase of the bloodline's strength. Introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, C.M. Punk! And his opponent from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Roman! I have a feeling we're about to see a classic, gentlemen. You can see the desire in these competitors' eyes reflected right back at them in the shine of that championship's gold. Now we're ready, the combatants are ready, and this one will determine the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. This is about creating your own opportunities and controlling your own destiny. For many, the undisputed WWE Universal Championship is what they strive for. You can't let the opportunity slip through your fingers. I'd have to think that a no disqualification match favors the most heartless competitor in the ring. Well, that's mostly true, but even the most rule-abiding superstars have risen to the occasion of a no-disqualification match. When there are no rules, there's no wrong and right. The Tribal Chief has it cinched in, and the Tribal Chief looking to put his opponent to sleep. Cravat sleeper on the ply. Body breaks free, but will the damage prove to be irreparable? He saw that one coming. Oh, CM Punk stopped that in its tracks. Oh. And Reigns is vulnerable. Man, that was a hard landing. Into a sleeper hold. Oh, a neck breaker. Getting out of the ring. Smart decision here. Shake off the cobwebs away from your opponent. Had an answer for the big dog. Elbow puts an end to that. Getting set up for something in the corner. Oof, running knee in the corner. He reverses it. Great counter. Yuranagi by Puck. He turns it. Wasting no time. Anaconda Vice. Oh, a couple of knees there. That'll get him out of it. Able to sidestep it. He is getting rid of the turnbuckle pad. Don't say that too loud, Saxon. You might get caught. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? to have been closer to three than he'd like. Oh, man. That hit connects from Roman Reigns. Oh, that is going to leave a mark. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. Puck wasting no motion on the counter. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Oh, 
Watch out! The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel. Uh-oh, uh sweet dreams coming! The God of Sleep GTS from Puck! The title's in jeopardy here! I think the paradigm has shifted. He's got him, getting ready. Spiked with a Uranagi. And now gets tossed into the ring. Spin kick to the midsection. Neck breaker after the float over. That was pretty. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Well, looking for GTS. Go to sleep. The title might change hands. From the top rope. Flying elbow drop. Oh, costly error there. And the champion finally ready to put this one away. He's on the ropes. The official sees it and waves off the pen. Oh, wait a second. And it's he was about to get worse. He wasn't expecting this, guys. Not at all. How disrespectful is this? Into the ring, no disqualification, completely legal. Reigns able to sidestep. He must have had that scouting. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Back suplex, spine crushing. Roman Reigns so dominant. Look at this, he let it go. Curious decision there, Michael. Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. Taking the fight near our announce table. I really hope we get these desks at a discount. Gets countered there. Steer clear of that. Regal flex. Looking for the victory. Two. And a kick out of two. This is what champions are made of. Always finding that deepest ounce of willpower. That final drop of fuel in the reserve. And a short clothesline. And we see him take yet another shot to the body. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. Check out the springboard. Clothesline! That was amazing. Here we go! Oh, God! I don't care how bold you are, missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility. A medical attention might be needed out here. That was a nasty landing. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. I hate to end up on his back and heavily whip inside right now. Neck breaker after the float over. That was pretty. You're a by Puck. He turned. And he lets him out of the submission holes. Could have been a strategic move to wear down that body part for something bigger later. What's he open to find down there? The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. Excellent ring IQ to see the ref's count return to the ring in time. Superman punch from Reigns. Is it enough? The cover! Two! Yeah, no. He doesn't get the three. The determination of the challenger keeps this match going. You can just see how much this title means, how much one is willing to go to to claim themselves as the new champion. Back elbow completely cuts them off. And counter with a knuckle sandwich. Taking it outside the ring now. When you're in an 
atmosphere like this when you can't hear yourself think because the crowd's so loud, you find a way to do superhuman things. That's what these combatants are doing here. And he slides him back to the mat. Reigns plans in motion. From the top. And a late game press from Reigns finds its mark. I have to imagine Roman is looking to end this soon. Launches into the air with a Superman punch. After that, it's easy to see why Reigns has been at his zenith. He's still got more left in the tank. He went right into that turnbuckle. Reversal! What a counter! Planet with a wicked DDT. Great counter. Big time height on that kick. There's electricity running through this arena right now. Will it be the spark for one of these competitors? Arm ringer. What a punch. Able to give him the slip. Punk has him trapped up across the shoulders. Jake Tears collects. Got to see a new champ for the win. There's two. And we have a new champion. Unbelievable. A lot of action in that match. Let's have a look. Here is your winner, and the new undisputed WWE Universal Champion, C.M. Punk. Once that attack happened earlier, I think we knew the way this match was heading. Here we see the seemingly inevitable outcome. After a loss like this, under these circumstances, I have to think it brews more bad blood here. Yeah, the word revenge.